There are two types of people in this world. There are people who will blame a lack of resources for a lack of their success, and we all know them, right? My company's rubbish, my boss is rubbish, I don't have enough staff, I don't have enough equipment, I haven't got enough money, I don't come from the right background. The economy's rubbish, Brexit. There's the people who blame the lack of resources and the events around them for the lack of the success, but then there's those people who get incredibly resourceful. I sat on my own, I had this dawning realization, what the hell have you done? I've got three children and a wife, the bills need to be paid in a month and I don't have any customers. So I thought, you know what? I'll ring up all the conferences in the UK and I'll get a speaking gig because if people can hear me and feel my passion, then I'll get some customers. So I rang the first one and I said, my name's Martin Johnson, I'm a motivational speaker. I wasn't, <laughs> right? I, I, she said, yes, Martin, if you can send us a video of you speaking in front of 200 people or more, right, I will put you on. And I went, well, I haven't got the video. If you put me on, I'll have the video. Sorry, Martin. So I rang every conference in the UK nobody would have me on unless I could prove with a video that I was competent enough to put on the stage and speak in front of people. And I just couldn't get a gig and time was running out. So here's what I did. I took 10,000 pounds of my own money, right? I hired the deep out for the evening. I, I created an event called T2 Talks. I convinced four other speakers to speak on the stage with me. We got 200 people from business in the audience. I hired a film group crew to capture it, all in the bid that I would finally have my video that would get me on the stage. Since then, we've sold out five T2 talks, so over 5,000 people, and we have 100,000 hits on YouTube. And guess who comes ringing for the speaking gigs now? <laughs> Too late, I'm busy. <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> I'm not, I accept it every time. But the point is, is I had to get resourceful. You know, all the things that you don't have get resourceful. That's what I've done all my career. It's no, nothing has ever been impossible for me, even coming from Sutton Park and Brandsome and having no education and going to the military. And I always told people I would have my own business and I would speak in front of people and everybody laughed. I always told people I would become an author and write a book and everybody laughed, right? Because the people who don't have the resources get incredibly resourceful and that's what I'd implore you to do.